All right, so we're getting these marked out. We got six of them to cut. Oh, they got the uh, equipment warming up here. <clears throat> yeah, we need to get that thing unchained and get the ramps down. <clears throat> we're gonna take all this, take the excavator off the trailer. All right, we just got that off. Get these ramps down, get this thing unloaded. Okay, we got the saw fired up, let it warm up. Dogs are having a blast right now. Sadie and Bud found a new friend. Oh, Sadie's doing her roll. She's getting, she's getting in the swing of things for the season, getting her snow roll. These guys are just happy as can be. Chad's gonna get the loader fired up. We're gonna get the cones from around back, bring those out. And get to cutting over here, get all this cut. And then we will Start drilling these holes. We got the auger right here. Two foot diameter holes that we're drilling. Brought the small one too. We may do pilot holes. We're gonna try with the big one first and see how that goes. But uh and you can't figure out how to start it. Turn the water on. And they got hot. Sadie and Bud got hot. They're laying in the snow cooling off they're on a standoff bud's got something okay let's get the drill out we'll go back and get those cones okay we're making progress here Goal will be to get all these cut and drilled today. We're on a tight, tight timeline here. Definitely gotta fix that windshield wiper for snow season. We had the rams rebuilt on that, so they're not leaking anymore. We got 24 cones back here to load. Get these loaded up. And hopefully we'll uh, 
make really good progress on this today. I'm optimistic we'll get it done. So we get these all loaded here, brought back around front so we can caution tape off each one that we do. Get the drill mounted onto the Mini X and uh, we'll be ready to rock and roll. All right, I just made it over here to the shop. Uh, Clayton's gonna take the dump truck and dump it. And then we'll get it up there to the parking lot job so we have uh, something to put all our spoil in. Looks like Chad's about got them all cut. So now Mike's gonna run down and grab the jackhammer. We're just gonna punch a hole in the center of all of these and uh, see if we can't <clears throat> start peeling it out. Hopefully we can peel it out without tearing up the edges. Huh? Do you wanna, do you wanna cut it up the center? Do you wanna... Well, the sun's out. You can see uh, <clears throat> whatever you would call those clouds, I guess. Still 24 degrees, pretty cold. Now I'm gonna go and see uh, that trenching job we were working on. I'm gonna go take a look at that and make sure everything looks good over there. We can get our electrician in there and uh, <clears throat> run his conduit and get that thing put back together. Looks like they got some caution tape up. Got it all dug. I think that's the electrician. Still gonna be a little bit of digging right there up against the edge. Putting a new panel. I think that's good enough. It's a pretty sharp turn there. It'll work. Beautiful day here, guys. Day after the election. Mike brought the uh, air compressor and the hammer over. We'll see if that's helping out for uh, getting this asphalt out. Looks like Chad's still messing with the saw. Oh, okay, there's one out. Got it right out, all in one piece, huh? Interesting. <clears throat> Compressor here. Now you know what I'm gonna. I got these little welding, welding uh, lenses. See, like it might be. You working out pretty good. The, the hammer work good. Yeah. Oh. Hey, uh, Trevor. I think Chad was a little afraid to bury the, bury the blade, but it's thick. I mean, some of that stuff's thick, thick. Ah. So he went so all the way through, so he was trying to lift back here, and I'm like, uh-uh. Yeah. We buried it down in there. You gotta go past for the ways, but. Yeah. Okay. Two of them out.
You're almost done. Now we're gonna get this thing on finally. Is it locked back on? Put it right here. You're gonna hook it up. Bring it over here and set it down in the dirt right here. Stab it in the ground right here. All right. So, kind of like what we thought. There's a lot of rock in there. All right, they're getting the last two holes drilled. We're gonna head on out. We're gonna have to figure out something on these, on the last probably foot on all of these holes is gonna have to be some handwork because the drill's just running into uh, too many issues. It's just too much rock. But they're getting, they're getting almost five feet. Got to get six. Good morning, everyone. We are, uh, we're back at it this morning. We got our cages delivered last night and we're just touching up these holes. The last of these holes, we got to get to six feet. It's really tough drilling. There's a ton of rock about that size in the holes. <laughs> so we're, uh, it's real slow going the last couple feet. Owen's going to get the trailer with all the forms on it. Where are we at? Five. <laughs> right at five. Yeah. We'll get them.
Well, these holes are just a real pain. A lot of big rock down there and the last part of it is really tough going. So we put the smaller drill on the dill, got the smaller one on there and we're punching, trying to punch down through like that one there is very shallow. It's got a long way to go. It's got to go like another two foot deeper. And it's just killing us. So I think we figured about 10 yards of concrete originally, it's gonna be probably 15 because the holes are just getting so big. Beautiful day today though guys, just a beautiful day. I cannot believe yesterday it didn't even get above 40 all day. And today you could almost be out here in a t-shirt. It's unbelievable. And look at the sky. Yesterday there was streaks all over the sky. The contrails, that some people call it contrails, but you know, today, not a single one, not a single one. So it's kind of amazing to me that we could have that much air traffic yesterday and zero, not a, nobody's flying today. It's a, it's a Thursday and nobody's flying. Apparently like no planes are flying today because there's not a single one, not a single one. Oh, there's one. There's a plane there and there's nothing behind it. I must be a that must be a battery powered plane. Okay, we got the first one set up. Owen's getting sauna tubes for the next ones. Six of these to do. We gotta have them done by about two o'clock today. We got our bolts for the lights. Gonna, I don't need this one. I'm gonna, yeah. I'm gonna use washer and then just save them. Yeah. We'll... <laughs> so here's all the lights over here. So these are all solar powered lights. Pretty cool. No trenching or electrical needed. And templates for bottom. We're gonna put the uh, Bigger drill back on now. A little slower than we wanted, but we're getting it done. Now we're gonna put the big one back on and try to clean out the bottoms and about as good as we're gonna get. Well, yeah, we're almost there. We punched through with the little bit as much as we could. Now we're cleaning them out with the bigger auger. I got a guy coming over with a five gallon bucket. We're just gonna have to hop down in the holes and uh, clean the last little part out by hand. We're, we're real close to six feet, but 
it's there's so much rock big rock like six to eight inch diameter rocks the whole thing Two more to do here. All right, I'm getting the last of it. Got to get it by hand. Probably gonna have to put the bucket on and dig these with the bucket and they're gonna be a lot larger but I don't know what else we can do. It's just not letting us drill. There's some large rocks down there and we just can't can't get them out. <laughs> no, Sadie. Sadie and Bud. Friday night shenanigans with Sadie and Bud. Another nice night at the house. Had a long day at work today. Lori and I. Look at me. Honey. She won't look. We got a fire going though. And we are just watching these, these folks here in uh, San Francisco right now. We normally don't watch the mainstream news. And so after the election, we decided we'd start watching it maybe a little bit more. And this right here is just a bunch of uh, people like blowing smoke up each other's asses pretty much about, you know, all these. It's a bunch of people that have never done anything. She has a big ship behind her, like a big industrial ship. And she has never probably touched a hammer in her life. So these are the type of people in these Bay Area, wherever they're at. And they are just blowing smoke. That's all they do. You're going to continue to do what? You have all the homeless people in the world on your streets. What are you going to do? Like you Oh, climate consciousness. Yeah. Of course you are. These people are out of touch with reality. Now, here's the little guy that has to give everybody a Oh, oh, this is a senator. No, well, she's out of touch too, I can tell. Oh, they're going to cut her off because she's, she's probably going to say stuff that's like, makes sense. So they're going to cut her off. But yeah, that's our night, Friday night, guys. Hope you guys are having a good one. Saturday morning. Still going at it. We got uh, brought the excavator over to this new job, or not new job, but the trenching job. And uh, 
Just got everything unchained and we're going to drop this thing off real quick. So that we can backfill. Gotta backfill this trench. Nice and slow off the trailer. Just gonna drop it off this morning and probably, I'll come back later, I got other stuff to do. But uh, just wanna get it here so that we can uh, jump right on it when it's time. Okay, got her all dropped off. I'm gonna get, uh, let it warm up a little bit, let the water unthaw, and we'll get some water going on this stuff. And we'll start uh, pushing all this dirt back in. I don't know what's going on with that. Seems like it's all like shaky. That was weird, my camera was acting up. Anyway, we got this dropped. Take the truck back over to the other job site. Drop this big old trailer off. And we'll come back up here and get this thing backfilled. Right, bud. I know. I know, bud. Well, we had two days of perfectly clear skies, not a single trail in the sky. And here we go, big ones, big long ones. Maybe um, somebody could explain that to me, like how the atmosphere works, where some days you don't get anything and then other days you get stuff like this. Uh, baffles my mind but anyways hope everybody's having a good saturday out there hope you guys enjoy this video i'm gonna go ahead and download it get it out and i'll get another one started for next week thanks for following don't forget to hit that like button comment let us know what you think and we'll see you on the next one